tell, 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 tell. Hello there, everyone. This is Vile, and um, welcome back. <coughs> well, actually, welcome to a new series. Um, this series is not based off of any of those games except for Minecraft. This is my tutorial series on how to play Minecraft Pocket Edition. Now, we're going to start out with the simplest version of survival. Well, we're going to start out with the version of survival, and eventually we'll move into creative. So, um, whenever you first access Minecraft Pocket Edition and you first open it, one, it might take a while to open. Load! Come on, guy. What's the matter? Uh, this is bad. Ah. Uh, there we go. It will open for you. And usually it will say Mojang. Hold on, give me a minute. Oh no. I'll hit that. I'll be right back whenever I get it. Oh, I am on, finally. It will open up like this. The words, the syntax on there will be different. By the way, um, I am on a different update right now. If you download the 0 0.7, then this is different. I'm on the 0 0.10.0 update of alpha mode. By the way, this game is also made by Mojang, so credit to Mojang. So I want you to know, whenever you push this play button, there will not be any worlds on this. They, it will be empty. There will be no worlds. You have to push new, but I'll explain that in just a little bit. Whenever you first go on, your name will be Steve, okay? So let's say S-T-E-E-V-E. -E S-T-E-V-E. -E. That's how you spell Steve. Now, you can choose... Sorry, everyone, I had to change the batteries in my camera. <coughs> so, you'll have... So, this is non-difficult. That means that there will be no mobs at all in survival. That is difficult. That means there will be mobs and they can hurt you. Um, multiplayer. In order to play with friends, you have to have the same Wi-Fi. Kind of stinks right now, but... Hopefully, that will be fixed in the future. I have no clue how to do realms. And third person view just means that you can see yourself. It's kind of hard to play in. Sensitivity, that just shows how fast the screen moves. I recommend keeping on it. D pad size, keep. Now, split controls, I'll explain later. Interview Y axis. You can play around with all these things. And brightness and all that. And sound. I have sound on. I should probably turn it up. There. So yeah, but whenever you click on new, recently in the 0 0.9 point, yeah, 0 0.9.2 update, they've added in two types of worlds. The original worlds were only a certain limit, now they are infinite and they have caves. Now, we're going to choose survival and we're going to name this Let's Plays. You can name it whatever you want. Okay, and then C just basically tells you what you're going to be doing, what the world's going to be like. So I'm going to say, good game er. Okay. Now, um, I'm going to create this world to infinite. Um, depending on what type of device, if you have an older device that isn't updated, this won't very much work. Okay, it's kind of laggy and infinite. It's not super good. But, um... Oh no. Okay, so I spawned in the middle of a random world. Right here where you're standing is spawn. And if you see that little arrow pad right there, well that arrow pad is the is what I use. Now there's two types of sayings for this, um, which I will show you in just a minute. Um Ah, and that's lag, okay? That's lag. It's whenever you kind of freeze. So um you spawn right here. I was staring this way, wasn't I? Yes. See there? That's a tree, if you did not know. I should hope that you are smart enough to know that that is a tree. Um, whenever you hold down, whenever you push down and it points at it, it will break the block. And you can change throughout blocks by just tapping there. So now, I now whenever you break the block, it adds to your count. And those are leaves, by the way. Uh... Here, now, if I go to... No, not quit the title. Wrong thing. 
Okay, I have lag. I have lag. I got lag. <laughs> no, wake up. Ah! So I've went on. Um, now, as you know, there's a little arrow pad pointing in the middle there. Well, if I go to options and I click on the s split controls, that thing disappears. And wherever you click is wherever you're going to break. Now, this by far is the easiest, but I prefer the interview y-axis for it. The not Y axis, uh, they split controls for this because it keeps my fingers out of the way. Now, you can break these if you want, they will eventually drop salmon. So, I have six pieces of wood. Here's your inventory, you have a limited amount of room. Here's your crafting, you have a four by four crafting space. The more that I click, it makes four oak planks, a crafting table, and eight sticks. Uh, I'm going to craft a pickaxe and a shovel. Those are two materials that I always craft. I do not craft a sword until I get some stone. Uh, of course, granite's in the way. Oh, there we go. Um, this is stone. Now, there are a few different types of blocks. So that's what you get into whenever you start to play creative mode. You can see all the types of blocks. So as you can see right here, I'm mining. Um, I probably have nine. I need a little bit more. Hopefully I'll run the coal. What was that? No. Dang it. <laughs> it's like, no, dang it. Oh yeah, that's gravel. Gravel and, uh, that's a different mechanic. That's a different game mechanic. Go, go. My difficulty's on right now. Um, if I click here, then I'm going to make a sword, an axe, I need some more sticks, a pickaxe, and a shovel. Oh yeah, see that tree? Um, it drops apples and saplings, the oak ones do. Any saplings anywhere? Saplings, saplings, give me your saplings. Come on, tree. I at least need one sapling. But an apple's food, and, that, and we'll get into food basics later. So um, now I have all my tools. I'm going to rearrange my bar. And we'll have that and that. Uh, let me switch. Now, you don't have as much room on your hot bar as the PC does. But, um... Oh, there's sheep. There's a chicken. Now, watch what happens if you tap on a chicken. Point the arrow at him. Tap. Oh, come on. Tap. Tap. Will you work? Now tap. It kills him! No! Yeah, um, you do not want to kill animals if you're in survival, because, one, they do not regenerate. But, for the first few nights, before you have any iron or anything, I at least kill three sheep, because that's how much it takes to make a bed. Three pieces of wool. So, I have one piece. They'll only drop one. But, I only kill three sheep, and then I don't kill any more animals, ever. Man, because it doesn't pertain to you that you need any any food in this version of the game. Because we do not have hunger bars. Uh, I gotta run to a tree and grab some wood, because we need more. Hi, Biggie. Now, babies don't drop anything, by the way. Oh, dark oak. Perfect. This is one of my favorite woods, besides spruce. Oh no, broke the wrong block. Great, now I gotta put a block back there. Mainly because that breaks how I always break it. Ooh, hey look. Tall, tall, tall mountain. Big mountain, big mountain, big mountain. <laughs> um, as you can see, the axe breaks faster than your fist does. Mainly because it's meant to chop down these trees. Dark oaks are have a lot more wood in them than it appears. See? Just keeps on going. Now dark oaks don't drop uh apples. And um as you can see, my you can normally see through tree leaves, so that causes me a lot of lag. 
Man, because it's only about rendering and everything that they have to have in Minecraft. Rendering distance and stuff. It's super annoying. Which we'll get into technical stuff later on. Whenever I kind of understand it some more. So, um, there we have it. There's some wood. Oh, that was just lag right there. That you saw, you know, like there's a block there, but I truly had broke it. Oh, yeah, by the way, something to mention is that saplings. That's a sapling. They, you can replant them. Ooh, I have lots of wood now. What was that? There. Good. Ah, Taiga? I don't know. No. Uh, this is gonna be pretty good. How much time have I been doing this? About three minutes or so? I'm not quite sure. Ah, you can drop me more. Because you need four saplings. <gasps> Another sapling! <laughs> oh, there's one. Where does it go? Great, Scott. Uh, as you can see, I have some dirt with me. And if I just tap, wherever the arrow is pointing, if I jump and tap, then I'll be able to catch, then I'll be able to place and jump. So yeah, but that's pretty, that's pretty cool, unique trick technique. Great, I'm good. Um, let's run back over to where spawn was at. Um, as you saw, I marked spawn. That's something that I always do. You do not have to do that. Oh, there it is. Oh, jeez. It's almost coming night. Now, to survive your first night, you are going to need to build a shelter. When I get back there, we'll build a very quick shelter. The one issue with me is that um, we don't have any coal, which we'll make some. Here's how you make some. There's, spec there's a specific way to make coal. Coal is very important in the game. Here's the spawn. There. Uh, let me place down my crafting table. And I'm just gonna make this all in the Now remember, it ma whenever one piece of dark oak wood, ma one piece of any wood just makes four planks. So here I have, now all blocks stack up to 64 blocks. So now I have a lot of wood. Now this is gonna be a perfect place for mobs to spawn, which equals monsters, which equals you dying if you're not fully equipped. But I have a sword, so I should be able to survive. But it's a little bit different because I I don't have armor. Uh, I'm quickly building. Say, <laughs> so, um, obviously I have a lot of wood. Now, um, you can only fit in a too high area. You can only jump up one block, but you can only fit in a too high area. Please, no creepers. Oh, gosh. We are in trouble. And I just have enough cobblestone to make myself a furnace. Uh, let me put in some wood. Uh, I just realized. Uh, yeah, we're just kind of hiding underground right now. This shovel is so slow. Uh, as you can see, no. Can I? Yeah, I can burn. So I got some food. I'm hiding, as you can see. Man, because I don't want to die, this would be a very bad video if that was happening. We have to cover different things. And if you hold down, then you can just shove the whole stack in there. Before any spiders get in, let's seal this up. Spiders are the only mobs that can climb up walls just randomly. Um, creepers are the only mobs that can climb ladders. Okay. Uh, should have saved some. 
long as it has enough light, light level's good. I hope. You scare me. <laughs> oh no! No! More wood! There, good. Uh, yeah, this is going very interestingly. Because I wasn't prepared. <laughs> I'm just showing it back in here. <laughs> this is my convenient way of keeping it light. Now, um, until I know that it's daytime. Still night. Um, I'm gonna quickly skip ahead in the video until it is daytime. Actually, it's 13 minutes long. Um, this is going to be the end of this episode. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed, and episode 2 will be out, um, tomorrow is when I want it to be out. Yeah, tomorrow. Um, so yeah, but, um, I will see you tomorrow on, on how to play Minecraft. Bye-bye!